In this video, let's create the modal UI for our time in and time out. Let's create a function that have a parameter called variant. It indicates what we've clicked, if it is time in or out. Let's create a new window with a title that based on variant. Now let's create our frame. Okay, now let's create another frame, but this time it has a label, and inside of it is our inputs. It's time for our employee ID input. I'll create a bind effect whenever our cursor clicked. The input deletes its placeholder. Okay, now for our password input. Lastly, for our time in or time out, but it's disabled so it cannot be changed. Oh, I forgot to put a command into our time and button. Let's put the value of our parameter in here. Okay, it works, but the theme is light. Let me fix something. Oh, it's modal instead of root. But our placeholder didn't delete it when we clicked. Forgot to put event as an E. Okay, now let's create our submit button. Also, let's create a function submit. Our submit function have a parameters modal, variant, E underscore ID, password, and time. But the value came from our inputs.
Let's print the parameters to check its values. Now let's create a condition that validates our inputs. If it is have a valid value, If the values are not valid, a message box will appear and return the function. And if it is valid, our modal will close. Yes, it works. Thank you for watching.